What's up, everybody? I'm back to talk another bit enough of this one. I am ranking the Annabelle films, the Annabelle trilogy. Now, um, as all y'all may know that's been watching my videos, I am a fan of the Conjuring universe. In my opinion, um, the, it's a special, you know, horror universe. But yes, there's are some that ain't perfect, but overall, it's um, it's a special horror universe in my opinion. So yeah, before I even begin this ranking video, I want to give you a shout out to Kyle Vada. He done a video just like this. Um, I thought why'd I do it? Because I never done, you know, a ranking of the Annabelle films. I did a ranking of the Conjuring Universe, you know, all of the Conjuring movies, all the Conjuring films in the Conjuring Universe, but I've never ranked the Conjuring I mean the Annabelle movies. So I thought why not do that? So yeah, he done that video. So these this is a similar ranking to his sort of so yeah, um, and I'm a huge fan of the Conjuring universe, and I can't wait for the Conjuring three. And this is one of the big reasons why I'm doing this ranking because of the Conjuring um three's coming out, which is we got a lot of months for that movie. But you know, there's gonna probably be some Conjuring videos I'm gonna be making or something. So yeah, so coming at my number three is the original Annabelle. Now. Just keep in mind, this is my opinion. Now, this movie, I mean, when I first saw this in the theaters a few years back, um, you know, I enjoyed it, you know, but the more I kept watching it, the more I started watching it, the more it started to become it. I started seeing a lot of flaws and all that stuff. I, like, to me, this one felt the cheapest. Like, this one, I didn't... See no good that good cinematography. There are some good shots in it, but not a lot. Um, but this film just felt more cheap to me. Um, so yeah, that's why this is my least favorite. But you know, I didn't care too much for the first Annabelle. I did when I first seen it, but it just ain't um, a great film. Coming in at my number two is Annabelle Creation. Now, this film, I feel like they brought it back. Um, this film, they brought it back. They brought this, you know, the Conjuring Universe back to life when they made this. And this film, good cinematography, good acting, good scares. This is probably the scariest one in the Conjuring um, Universe. I wouldn't say the scariest one, but... Um, it is the scariest out of the Annabelles, but it just ain't my number one favorite, and I'll explain to you why my number one favorite in a second. Um, but this film, the story I thought was, you know, decent. It wasn't the best way in my opinion, but I love the jump scares, I love the cinematography, I love the acting, and that's what counts. So yeah, this has, I like it how they have that slow boil, you know, in the film, and um, they get to the good stuff towards the middle, and it was just amazing. I, I enjoyed this film. Coming in at my number one is Annabelle Comes Home. Now, Annabelle Comes Home, um, before I even saw this in the theater, I heard people talk about um, like how horrible it was. I was like, I don't I know what they was talking about because I actually enjoyed the film. I heard a lot of people say it was horrible, it wasn't a good movie and all that stuff. But when I saw the film, I was expecting it to be horrible. So when I saw the film... I enjoyed it. Um, the good camera shots, and I felt like this one, in my opinion, this had a great story because it's it's like you can consider this as like the um, Night of Museum of the Conjuring Universe. You know, the Night of Museum where all this haunted objects come to life. I like that concept. Great story, and um, it had the best story in the Annabelle films. In the three Annabelle films, this one, I felt like it had the best story, in my opinion. And I feel like this one had the best cinematography. I feel like this and even had the best acting. And the soundtrack was great. This is what the Conjuring um, universe is known for. is great soundtracks. Even in the worst one. Great soundtracks. Um, the soundtracks sound creepy and scary. And um, that's what I love about it. And Annabelle Comes Home is just great. Um, there are some flaws, but not a lot, you know. It didn't have, I barely have any flaws with the film. Um, I barely have any flaws with it. Um, as y'all may tell, if y'all seen Kyle video, this is sort of the same one because, you know, um, I actually um, liked 
<laughs> like the first the, the first Annabelle is my least favorite and it shows that in this video so it's like almost the same video but yeah um so if you haven't checked out Kyle Vowder's ranking video of the Annabelle films please check his video out but yeah Annabelle comes home um I love this film I could actually rewatch this film this is the one I could actually rewatch the most probably I have Annabelle films but um yeah, um, and I'm a huge fan of the Conjuring universe, and my favorite Conjuring movie is probably the Conjuring Two. Um, and I might do like revisiting reviews out of all of them before, before you know Annabelle Three comes out. You know Annabelle the Devil made me, I mean the Conjuring Three the Devil made me do it. Um, once that comes out, um, I'm like once that's almost here, once that film's almost here, um, I might. Revisit the whole, you know, Conjuring universe and stuff. So yeah, Annabelle comes home. Great film. If you haven't seen the Conjuring universe, what are you doing? If you're horror fans, you will love the Conjuring universe. So yeah, Annabelle comes home. Good movie. So yeah, now let's. I do this in like almost all my rankings. This is what I do. So yeah, the um first Annabelle. I'll give it a 6.5 out of 10. Um, Annabelle Creation. 10 out of 10. Annabelle Comes Home. 10 out of 10. So, yeah. So, that's it. So, yeah. Um, I enjoy the um, Conjuring Universe. So, yeah. Let me know in the comments below. How would y'all rank, you know, the Annabelle, you know, franchise? Like, the Annabelle trilogy. Let me know in the comments below. Y'all rank them like, like you know, and I agree with Kyle Vider when he said don't make they shouldn't make no more you know, um Annabelle films. They shouldn't make no more Annabelle films. Um, let's leave it at a trilogy, a good trilogy for the Conjuring universe. Um, but I wouldn't mind them um doing two more, um, Conjuring movies. You know, in the main series like the Conjuring three and four, maybe even the Conjuring five and then the there. And then do a few more spin-offs, different spin-offs, and then leave it there. After that. So yeah, I don't mind that. But I think the con and um, Annabelle one, two, and three don't make no more Annabelles. But they could I I wouldn't mind them making at least two or three more conjuring movies in the main series. So yeah, I guess that's it for this video. If you enjoyed this video, please hit the like button, please subscribe and share, and also hit the bell so you know new videos uploaded. Peace out. Hope y'all enjoyed this video, and I'm out. Peace.